The speech of President Putin and the announcements he made both on this referenda and uh, on the partial mobilization, this is just another proof of, uh, of Putin that he is not interested in peace, that he is interested in escalating his war of aggression. This is also yet another sign of his desperation with how his uh, aggression is going against Ukraine. And uh, as I mentioned, this announcement, so this mobilization, partial mobilization, together with the, uh, with the confirmation of, uh, of the referenda, this is a clear signal also to the entire international community, especially during this crucial week in the General Assembly of the United Nations in New York, this is a clear sign, uh, signal to them that he is only interested in further advancing and continuing his destructive war, which had already so many bad consequences worldwide, not only for Ukraine in terms of so many atrocities committed, but it has negative consequences for every country in the world uh, because it's fueling the food crisis, the energy crisis. And this is just showing to the international community that he wants to continue not to contribute to solutions of this crisis, but he wants to uh, make this crisis deeper and continue with his war. So this aggression has negative consequences, not only for Ukraine, not only for the uh, world community, but also for the Russian population itself. And uh, it's not only attack against Ukraine, this is attack on core principles of the international community, UN Charter, and basically it's an attack against every peace-loving country that subscribes to the principles of international law and sovereignty and independence of the nations and, of course, United Nations Charter.